Uh, I think you missed a spot. Oh, hey, man. Yeah, I haven't got there yet. Um, I'm, just, right. I'm just working. On this Make sure board. you get that, because I don't play if I have smudges on the base, okay? Okay, I'll, I'll do it now. I just, I just haven't got to that spot yet. I think I still see some smudges. All right. No, I think it's not good enough. I think it's um, I think it's pretty clean. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna polish it. <laughs> 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 it's, uh, this is Tristan. He's uh, <laughs> tacking for us on this tour. Doing a great job. <laughs> Killing it. Cheers. How's your tour been so far? It was actually pretty stressful <laughs> at the start, <laughs> but it's been awesome. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's your first time working with us, right? Yes. It's always hard yes. coming into a new gig, but now yeah, you're killing it. Uh, yeah, the two shows in Melbourne killed me. Um, but, yeah, I mean, the last two have been great. Yeah. Um, yeah, awesome band to work with. Thanks for having me. I'll make sure I'll polish your bass. Make, <laughs> make sure it's looking... <laughs> I want it to look like a black mirror, okay? What's going on? Back in the dressing room here. We are in Australia on tour, playing our last show of the Australian tour tonight here in Brisbane. I'm just backstage in our dressing room, and the locals keep telling me it's actually called Brisbane, not Brisbane. Um, so that's something I'm learning here. But having a great tour, super fun time, really excited to be in Australia. So welcome backstage, welcome to the video. Thanks for joining us. Uh, let's go check out the venue. So I'm just walking outside the venue. I was trying to leave to go and explore the city and I can only find these bars and I'm literally trapped in here like a jail. But it, it was a blessing in disguise because I ran into Connor and Jody here. <laughs> and it, I, I feel weird how we're separated by these bars. Um, but anyways, they're coming to the show. Have you guys seen the band play before? Or is it your no, first time? first time. I've seen Andy on his solo tour. Yeah. But I was never old enough to come see you guys. Oh, okay. So now, finally. 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 And you were saying this is a birthday present for you, right? My 50th. Yeah. yeah. 50th birthday present. Coming to see Black Blackfield Bell Prize. Bell Prize. <laughs> That's incredible. Well, happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah, no, I do film at school and uh, I literally watch your videos all the time because they're so fun. Um, Thank you so much. What's your favorite song from the band? I like Lost one? It All. Oh, yeah. yeah that's very... But you're not playing that one either, are you? We're not, no. I'm, I'm just disappointing so hard yeah, today. Right. See, I like the <laughs> daughter, but I'm told that's annoying. Yeah, we're not playing that one either, so it's um, going to be a disappointing show. <laughs> Born Again's good, too. Oh, we're not playing that one I either. Know. So. Goodness. <laughs> What are, at least you're playing. What are the we last playing? One. In the end. In the end. We are playing in the end. See, I like yes. this. I'm really confused because all the set lists have been different that I've been looking at, so I don't know. Yeah, well, we, we try to change it up as much as we can, yeah. you know, to kind of keep it fresh. Oh but no, it'll be a fun show. You know, we got a lot in store, um, and the venue's really cool. I was just checking it out. The roof is surprisingly really cool in there. I had my which... graduation here. <laughs> oh, you did. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Well, good yeah. to see they're getting use out of this venue. Maybe you know how I can leave. No. I'm just I'm like. Thinking I might have to hop the fence. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I was like, maybe hop the fence over the top. Your side stage with John. Y'all know John. Yes, sir. How's uh, the tour been for you so far? In it's Australia? been a good one. It's been a uh, somewhat of a beat down, but you know that's standard issue, I guess. The travel schedule has been insane. We've been pretty much waking up at 5 a.m. every day, catching flights every morning, and then playing late shows. Anyways, you guys probably know John from previous tour vlog episodes as our guitar tech. Yep. And you've actually switched over to be our monitor engineer now. I am on so. stage left now. I have made it over to this side. I've done both sides now. Used to be over there. 
Now he's over here. Yeah. So our last monitor engineer, who was also named John, funny enough, it's a prerequisite to do monitors for us. Your name has to be John. Uh, he's out working with Pierce the Veil now. So this John is uh, doing monitors. So yeah. you want to show us uh, the monitor rig here, maybe? Uh, sure, yeah. So um, we are using uh, the Digico SD11. It's nice and compact. It packs a lot of punch for uh, for what it's doing. You know, we got a bunch of layers of instruments and you know all the vocals and drums and guitars, bass, all the stuff that we need to make the rock show. Um, we have our playback rig, which is this beautiful MacBook Pro running uh, Ableton Live. You know, then we got some wireless mics for uh, for lead vocals. Then we have our uh, in-ear transmitters over here going into our in-ear receivers. So uh, everybody hears everything on stage without, you know, wedges or side fills. So it's pretty sweet how it all works together. Busy guy. Man. <laughs> Actually, I wanted to point this out here. So Ultimate Ears hooked us up with some new in-ears. Everyone got new in-ears. And the in-ears themselves are great, but they actually misspelt my name nice. on the case. So I'm a, I'm a little I'm a little upset about that, you know. Oh, it, yeah. So the ears are good, but you know. Yeah. Seriously. Backstage here with Rich, assistant tour manager, production assistant. Uh, you have many roles with us. Yes. You're killing it. Yeah. And you might hear uh, Boris out there checking the mic. You might hear the occasional yer from out yeah. there. But uh, try try to not let that bother you. Anyways, yeah, Australia's been great. How you been liking Australia? Dude, it's been awesome. It's been like crazy weather and all that stuff but like everywhere we've been to has been awesome mm -hmm. the zoo yesterday man oh my gosh yeah. the sanctuary sorry we went to the lone pine koala sanctuary we got to hold and hug koalas and it was honestly the yeah. most spiritually uplifting thing of my life yeah dude. i think it was just like pure happiness the moment we stepped <laughs> in there was a smile on everybody's face the entire time dude yeah like that's was... that, those pictures are like the happiest I've seen everybody. <laughs> I know. Like... One, one of the great parts about touring in Australia, you know, it, it's my first tour here, your first tour here as well, yes, right? Yes, absolutely. So we're like, we got to see some koalas. We got to feed kangaroos too. That was amazing. Saw little joeys coming out of the pouches and stuff, dude. Yeah. It was so sweet. <laughs> you got to do that stuff when you're on tour, right? You know, because, you know, you have two choices. You can sit in the inside of a hotel room and watch TV. Or, you know, sometimes you need the rest. But I love going out and seeing koalas when I get the chance. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, dude. Me too. <laughs> it was awesome. Anyways, going to be a good show tonight. Let's do it. It is the morning after the show here. I'm just out uh, exploring Brisbane before we fly home. 
got an evening flight tonight, so just checking out the city here. And just wanted to kind of reflect on the show and the tour as a whole. Um, so last night was great. I thought it was a fantastic way to end the tour. You know, crowd was singing along super loudly, which I always loved. Great energy in there, cool venue, great vibe. Great way to end the tour. And the tour as a whole, just awesome. I really love Australia. It's such a privilege to be able to come out to this part of the world and share some music. It's been a blast, really. So thanks to everybody who's come to a show on this tour. And if you don't live in Australia and you didn't make it to a show, then you know, thanks for hanging out with us in the vlogs here and being a part of it this way in uh, videos like this here on the channel. Really appreciate that. And to just get uh, a bit more personal with it, you know, I've been thinking like a lot of the bands that I majorly am influenced by are from Australia. I don't know what it is about Australian music, but I just really connect with it for some reason. Uh, ACDC, the band that made me want to play guitar in the first place. They're from Australia. In Excess, one of my other favorite bands. Michael Hutchins being my favorite front man in rock and roll. So to kind of to come to this part of the world and share my own music in the cities that these guys got their start in, where they came up in, where they lived in, it's very cool. Very inspiring for myself to be able to do that. So yeah, Australia's been great. Hope to come back very soon. And uh, yeah, anyways, we have an 8.30 p.m. flight tonight, flying back home. We have four days off coming up. And then we are flying back to the United States Midwest for some more festival dates over there. So lots more stuff coming up, lots more videos coming up on the channel here. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet, if you want to see more behind the scenes tour content from me. I've always got more videos in the works, so stay tuned for those. Anyways, uh, yeah, greetings from Australia. Thanks for checking out the video today, everybody. I'm Lon Eagleton, and uh, we'll see you very soon in the next one. Take care.